Welcome to a new Adventures of a Tar Heel. We're doing something different today. We're going to talk about an upcoming trip we have and some of the plans we've made. We're starting off in the Midwest and making our way to Vancouver. We've never been to Vancouver before, so this is our first trip. The first day we're going to kind of take it easy and see Stanley Park and Vancouver Aquarium and then Vancouver Lookout that evening. Day two we're going to go on a whale watching cruise. And in the afternoon, we're going to try to get to Science Place and check that out. On our third and last day, we're going to head out to Kapalana Suspension Bridge. There's a shuttle that goes there from Canada Place, so we're going to pick that up and probably explore Canada Place when we get back before we head out, get ready to head out on our cruise the next day. Our hotel is pretty close to Canada Place, so we're going to head down. We have an early embarkation time, so we're going to get on board and have a little lunch. And the first stop on the cruise is going to be Ketchikan. Um, we do have an at-sea day first, but when we're in Ketchikan, we're going to be doing the Misty Fjords uh, boat excursion, which goes down into Misty Fjords National Park. Um, it should be really cool. Um, a lot of the plane expeditions in Ketchikan have recently been canceled because of the accidents earlier this year. So thankfully, that we already had a boat uh, reserved, so it shouldn't impact us too much. At Icy Strait Point, we're going on a small bear search. They offer that on the cruise, but we decided to book it from an outside vendor because the smaller group size, based on the reviews, looked like they had a better chance at seeing bears when they were out hiking. So we ended up going with that one. From there, we sail over to Juneau, and there we decided to do dog sledding. And we're splurging a bit here. We went with an outside vendor as well here because we are a low window for booking excursions because we're only on silver status on the Disney cruise. So we weren't sure that there were going to be any of these left by the time it got to us when they opened up. So we booked really early and got a helicopter ride to a glacier with dog sledding on the glacier. So that one should be really good. I hope that the weather, the weather's the big question mark there. Sometimes it cancels due to bad weather, windy weather, and the helicopter can't fly. So fingers crossed on that one. Sitka's our last stop in Alaska, and we plan to take a tour of the totem poles in the National Park as well as of the Raptor Center. That's a ship excursion, so we're looking forward to that and just kind of touring the town of Sitka. Um, the next port after that and the last port on the trip is Victoria. We're actually meeting up with some family members there that recently moved to Seattle and hanging out. The next thing we did was just looking at what to pack. We've never done an Alaska cruise or been to Alaska, and we've never been to Vancouver before so a big question for us was you know what do we pack for this trip so here are some of the things I'm packing and um, just want to kind of see if anyone has comments about what did you take when you went to Alaska do you think there's things on here I'm missing do you think there are things on here that you took but didn't need I'd love to hear some comments on that if you guys have any tips other than that if you guys have any tips about any place we're planning to go or things that we're not listing here that we you think we should take in. Um, we still have a couple weeks left before our trip. I'd love to hear thoughts from people who have been before. Um, what should we see? Um, any tips on what we should bring? Thanks. Thanks for watching and have a great day. I'll post some videos after we get back.